Hello friends, today in this video I am going to show you how we can measure the output waveform of a computer UPS. Here I do not have a computer UPS but I have the battery UPS circuit and this transformer that I have taken out from a computer UPS in the past. So test the output waveform we need a DSO138 oscilloscope kit and a step down transformer. Here I am going to show you two ways to measure the output waveform. One is using the step down transformer and one is without using this transformer. So this transformer is necessary because the output of this UPS circuit is 220 volt. So it is dangerous for this oscilloscope kit and it can destroy this oscilloscope kit. So I am using this step down transformer. So you can select which method suits uh, perfect for you. Here is the 220 volt input wire of the UPS that is connected to 220 volts 50 hertz main supply. So before connecting these wires to the main supply, it is necessary to connect this transformer to the output wire of the UPS and this light bulb. It is necessary to attach a load to the output of the UPS, otherwise the UPS circuit will automatically turn off at no load condition. Here is the output wire of this UPS and we have to connect this transformer and this light bulb in parallel to the output of this UPS circuit. And here is the output wire of this step down transformer so connect this output wire of the step down transformer to the input probes of the DSO138 oscilloscope And now our connection is ready. And now I am going to turn on the UPS circuit. And here you can see the waveform of this UPS circuit in the oscilloscope. So here is a modified square wave. So this UPS circuit output a modified square wave and not a pure sine wave so it is a modified square wave inverter now I turn off the UPS and now I am going to connect this 220 volt input wire of the UPS to the main supply and again turn on the UPS and we can see this time the output of the UPS is a pure sine wave this is because the out the invert UPS circuit directly connects the mains to the output and mains is a sine wave supply so it directly connects to the output and the output waveform is a pure sine wave what in inverter mode when there is no means if I turns off the means then the inverter the UPS circuit acts an inverter and uh, the output is a modified square wave so now I am turning off the main supply and you can see the output of this UPS okay. circuit is again now use the second method to test the output waveform of this UPS circuit for this turn off your computer UPS and then remove this step down transformer from the output of this UPS
and here are the blue and red wire of this transformer so kindly remove this wire from the UPS circuit and then connect the probes of the DSO138 kit to these terminals Before connecting, remove the black wire of the battery. So you can see that I have connected this positive alligator clip to this positive terminal and this I have connected this black alligator clip to this terminal and now connect this red wire to this terminal and connect the blue wire of this transformer again on its terminal and now uh, again connect the black wire of this UPS to the battery now turn on the UPS again you can see the output waveform and you can also see the frequency of this output is 50 hertz so so now we can say that output of a computer ups is a modified square wave and not a pure sine wave so it thanks for watching